All right, welcome to the show. My name is Dylan Black. This is Daytime Ottawa on Rogers TV. She is back in town and she has a big show. It's happening, of course, uh, at the NAC this Thursday. You can check her out live. The new CD is called The Ice Queen. It comes out in March. How about we hear the title track right now? Sue Foley is on Daytime Ottawa. There you go. That's the Ice Queen, Sue Foley. Amazing, amazing to have you back. Ice Queen, you're not really an Ice Queen though, are you? Um, well, I'm from Canada, <laughs> yes. so that's part of the concept. It's yeah. um, a Canadian um, concept, you know, like I'm a northerner and I've recorded this album down in Texas. Mm -hmm. So um, down there, down in the south, they kind of know me as the Canadian blues person. and mm -hmm. So that's part of my identity. I don't think, you know, as, as for that song, the title track, that kind of talks about the idea of the nice queen and what people think a nice queen is when they say she's a nice queen, yeah. you know. Um, and I tried to make it a compassionate look at that idea because um, I think 
I think in, really everybody can be an ice queen at some point in their life when mm -hmm. they, you know, you kind of shut yourself off. Of course. Yeah, so, yeah. but no, I'm not really, no. Yeah, okay, good, <laughs> well, good. Okay, so, so this is your first uh, solo album in about, uh, uh, so your first album in six years, first solo album in about 10 years or so? Yeah. Okay, mm -hmm. uh, and you recorded it down in, in Texas. In Austin, Texas, yeah. Is that where the collaborations grew then? Because you have some pretty cool people on this disc with you. Yeah, well, I started my recording career down in Austin, Texas. Um, back in 1992 uh, with Antone's records and um, so a lot of these people that are on the album were just people around town like um, you know members of Jimmy Vaughn's band George Big Beat Range is one of the greatest Texas blues drummers and um, Derek O'Brien and Charlie Sexton from the Archangels and then Chris Layton is on it from Double Trouble Stevie Ray Vaughan's original band mm. and then and then we got the big guns of you know Jimmy Vaughn and and Billy Gibbons. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Because so you actually uh, you looked up to these people when you were becoming like you were getting your off your career off the ground. Oh my God! Yeah. I mean, to us, people like Jimmy Vaughn was like you know, godlike to us, right? Yeah. Like, cause you know, there's a few people I've seen in my life, and Jimmy Vaughn, Billy Gibbons, those people kind of change your life the way they play music. I mean, ZZ Top. I mm -hmm. mean, I think changed rock and roll. Yeah. Really, you know, yeah. so. Yeah. Did you get a chance to touch that beard? Because it's that iconic beard of Billy Gibbons. I have Gibbons. a picture of me dressing <laughs> Billy, actually. <laughs> oh, to dressing him, well, okay. Well, you know, like fixing his tie. So, yeah, I guess totally I, I might have brushed the beard Inter at the time. Interesting. <laughs> okay, so you've got a big show. When's the last time you played in, in, uh, in Ottawa? Boy, it's been a while. It's probably been five or six years yeah. in Ottawa proper. Yeah. Wow. But you've dropped mm -hmm. by the NAC in the past? Yeah, yeah. Is it I a real honor to see? Yeah, because, the, I mean, it's the National Arts Centre. It's the best place. How yeah. cool is it to be up on that stage? It's the best. Yeah. It's the best. Okay. Yeah. The new CD, uh, so it, it, is it out? It's not out yet. March 2nd. March we have to 2nd, wait. it's out, but we do have CDs with me. So it's the only place you can actually get the physical CD right now and mm -hmm. hear the whole thing. And it is, I'm really proud of it. You know, it's available for pre order right now, so, but it won't be officially the whole thing out um, okay. until March 2nd. Can you tell us about some of the other themes that you can find on the CD? Well, it's about, um, you know, it's kind of got a little bit of everything, but it's, it's, you know, it's a lot about relationships. I always write about relationships, and, and most of it's personal stuff. I don't write, I always say I don't write fiction, so what you hear in the lyrics is what I've experienced. Um, you know, I'm an artist, I've been around for a long time, and I've been playing a long time, and there's a lot of guitar on it for the guitar fans. Um, so I do a lot of that in the show, too, you know. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's, I've been doing this for, yeah, for a while. Yeah, some time. Well, yeah. we know you. Uh, oh, what, 17 Maple Blues nominations at this time? Awards, awards? actually, yeah. Awards, sorry, you've actually won 17 I have awards. Won, yeah, then. Okay, I, you see, I thought I read that wrong, because there's no. no way anybody's won 17 of them. I actually did. <laughs> A few good years there. <laughs> and chances are hopefully. you'll get a couple more yeah, with this. Hopefully, this yeah. is amazing. Sue, uh, the show Thank is you. this Thursday, as we mentioned, National Arts Center. And yeah. the Ice Queen is coming out to March 2nd. SueFoley.com. Thank you very much for being here. Thanks, Dylan. Always a pleasure. Yeah. We've got more daytime coming up in moments right here on Rogers TV. It's a packed show. I'm Dylan Black, and it's great to have you here as always.